Hey everybody, this is Stuart. It's time for Stuart's Super Sunday Sepia Tone Serenade. Thank you so much for joining us. And as you know, I am not the only one that stars on the Serenade. It's me and my two co-stars. Uh, my first co-star, his name is Bailey. Let's introduce him. Come on, Bailey. Come on, Bailey. Come on, Bailey. Come on, Bailey. This is Bailey. This is Bailey. And then the princess. Then the princess. Come here, Rosie. Come here, Rosie. Come here, Rosie. Come here, Rosie. I can't really see her. Come on, Rosie. Get in the wheelchair. I don't want to get up. Rosie doesn't want to get up out of the chair. Thank you for joining us. Uh, we're here every single week, as long as I'm not in the hospital, for your entertainment pleasure. For those of you who have emailed, who are concerned about the surgery I had, I had um, lower lumbar decompression surgery, and I just went to the doctor on Friday. I saw the surgeon. It's been six weeks, and he was, I'll use this adjective, he was completely floored by how well I was doing. He, he, he didn't think I was going to be doing as well as I'm doing for months. I am so determined to get better as soon as possible. I want to play shows this summer and I, I think that's going to happen. I'm sure I'm going to make a hundred percent recovery and if not a hundred percent then like 98 percent and uh, I'm doing really well. Uh, we got some other housekeeping chores to tend to. For those of you who don't know I don't know how you can not know because it's a mass phenomenon going around. I will be starring in a reality show that starts Wednesday of next week on Netflix. It's called Jewish Matchmaking. I'm not allowed to say what happens to me, but you need to watch that. I'll be on that show. It's called Jewish Matchmaking, and it was a blast filming it, and I'm hoping to be on season two. And we'll just have to cross our fingers and see what happens. Uh, in addition to that, my new album comes out May 19th. And um, for only for Serenade viewers, you could buy an advanced copy. I'll put a link in the comments. I know some of you have not bought it yet. It's only $10. I do this every single week for free. Uh, this is the first thing I've ever, first time I've ever asked anything of you. Download the record. It's $10 for Serenade viewers. I put my heart and my soul in this record. There's 15 songs. It's a monster album. There's also a bonus track on there for you guys. And um, what could I say? It's a great deal for $10. The puppies helped out. The first single was released. It was called Sins. And obviously that's on there. And that's gotten unbelievable reviews. I've posted all these reviews on Facebook. I didn't even know people reviewed singles. People, things have changed so much since um, since I was young and listening to lots of music. It used to be all about albums, and you reviewed the album. But now with Spotify and all these different services, a lot of people don't deal with the albums, and they just hear the song, and now they review the songs. So anyway, there's several reviews on Facebook. Um, I posted. There's an interview with me. I posted on Facebook. There's an article in the Daily Herald. Um, there's several different things. Thank you for those of you who are following. And the second single is called Way Back Home. That's going to be released the same day as the show, May 3rd. And um, I don't know. This wasn't really my choice for the next single. My manager wanted to um, do this as the next single. I wanted to do a song called Little Girl Blue, which I like a lot. I think it's more original sounding. And I posed it as a question to Facebook viewers and um, Facebook followers, and people all responded that uh, The Way Back Home should be the next single. So I stand corrected. We're going to do The Way Back Home as the next single. I'm going to play that for you today. And I have one final announcement. There is a spin-off show from The Serenade. After all this time, you know, like, there would be like Happy Days, and then Laverne and Shirley would be a spin-off of that. There's a spin-off show of the Serenade. It stars me and the puppies. It's on Instagram. I've never done Instagram before, but my manager said that's where all the young people are, and I have to start doing Instagram and what's the other one called? TikTok. I have to do those. Um, she's actually doing it for me, but I send her clips to post. 
The new spinoff show, it doesn't exactly have a title yet, but the new spinoff is me trying to teach Rosalita and Bailey math. We go through math problems, and I'm trying to teach them math. They're extremely smart puppies. They don't get it yet. I say to um, Rosie, how much is one finger plus one finger? And then she's supposed to go like, like that to answer the question. We're working on that, and we're doing this kind of documentary film series on teaching the dogs how to um, do math. So um, if you're interested in that, you have to join, uh, follow me on Instagram, however that works. And you'll be able to follow not only the serenade, but you'll be able to watch the dogs learning math. Okay, so um, that brings us up to the song for the week. This is called The Way Back Home. I have not played this probably since we recorded it, which was a while ago. Actually, it's kind of a lie. I just strummed through it just for like a minute before I started this picture. I remembered the chords. I have the lyrics in front of me, but not the chords. This is called The Way Back Home.
Thank you, everybody. Um, I was going to say a little bit about what that song's about. That's about getting a little bit of clarity in your life. Um, just a little bit of hint from the universe that what you're doing is the right thing. A little bit of reassurance. The idea, keep doing what you're doing. Keep doing, stay patient. You'll be rewarded for it. Um, that seems an apropos time for, apropos song for the spring and for some of the stuff that's going on with me. Uh, that's called The Way Back Home. Interesting note, um, the graphic designer for the CD somehow, instead of putting The Way Back Home, just put Way Back Home. So um, the liner notes say Way Back Home, and I didn't want to contradict it on... Um, the digital platform, so now the song's called Way Back Home, not The Way Back Home, but call it anything you want as long as you listen to it and buy the album. Again, I'll put the link in the description to get a copy of the album. Remember, it is mandatory for all Serenade viewers to get a copy. It's only $10. That's nothing. 15 songs. It's less than a dollar a song. I implore you to get the album. And um, say this with me, until next time, please help unfuck the world, it's all we got.